Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's episode of DIY with Bumblebeam, we are going to make a metal organizer made out of an tray. So if you want to know how I did it, please keep on watching and let the tutorial begin. So the things that you need for this metal organizer are egg tray, paint, so in this video, I used white paint but it's up to you on what color you will use. You also need a cutter. So special shout out for those kids who wanted to recreate this DIY. Please ask help from your parents or older siblings when using the cutter. I also used paintbrush, glue, glitters, push pins, double sided tape, folder, and of course don't forget your medals. First step is to cut your tray into sections depending on the size that you prefer. As you can see, I already painted the tray with white paint and while it's still wet, I added some glitters on it. I used yellow glitters because I thought it was gold, but I don't I think I don't see any difference, so never mind. So comment down below if you have observed something wrong in this video, okay? Since my paint dries so fast, I decided to apply some glue on the part where no or less glitters were applied. that we are going to add some glue on each side of the tray and place it on your folder actually what I have right now is a thin sheet of paper from a carton the next step is to cut the excess part make sure to follow the shape of the tray and place a double-sided tape and don't forget to remove the cover of course Once you're done, place it on your wall depending on the style that you wanted to create. Position your metals on each part and secure it with a push pin. So it's very simple and you don't have to spend so much money to buy those organizers. What if you try and do it yourself? And remember the best thing in doing DIY is that you can actually get the design that you want since you were the artist and you were free to do anything. So that's it guys, don't forget to subscribe, click the bell button so that you will be notified whenever I upload a new video and you're free to leave your requests and suggestions in the comment section below. So see you on my next video, bye bye!